The winds in New Mexico are making it for crew, making it difficult for crews to assess the damage in Dexter. County officials are asking to declare Dexter a disaster area after a tornado ripped through the town yesterday. As News 13's Elena Mendoza tells us, why work was halted in Dexter today, Elena? Yeah, Jess, cleanup efforts have been stopped here for now. Officials say it's just too dangerous to work outside with these strong winds. There's too much danger of flying debris. We are working as fast as we can with the conditions that we have. Many still aren't being allowed in their homes for that reason. Five people are recovering from minor injuries. At least 10 homes in Dexter were severely damaged, and there could be more in the county. Officials say around 150 cows from several dairies have had to be put down due to sheet metal that cut them up. The National Weather Service says they do believe it could have been an F2 tornado. We caught up with one woman last night who was in her home when the roof was torn off. The next door neighbor's little Fifth wheel is now on top of my car. Uh, we had a basketball pole, which I have no idea where it's at. We always have them out in the fields, but we don't have them inside the city limits. So uh, it, it, I would say a state of euphoria, pretty much shock. The Red Cross has a shelter set up in Hagerman. They say about 10 people stayed overnight and expect more tonight as the town has been evacuated, as I mentioned. And as far as the declaration of emergency, the county is requesting financial assistance from the state. Jess? All right, thank you, Elena. State police have called in several officers from other districts to help secure a perimeter around Dexter to prevent potential looters. All roads into Dexter, including State Road 2, are closed Dexter schools will be closed for the rest of the week.